And welcome everyone, it's me Picky Gemi here. Welcome back to more Mutants Genetic Gladiators news. So guys, um, it's next two weeks, but we've got a lot of things coming up. Black Friday, um, I believe, is it um, Thanksgiving coming up soon as well? Anyway guys, we've got a lot of information to, deal with, to go through, and I've also got a lot of videos to record. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm so far behind schedule, I streamed for too long last night. And it was Among Us, in case you're wondering. Anyway, guys, um, let's get into it. Let's see what's coming up this first next two weeks, shall we? Again, will you be fast enough? We've got a speed box available. If I'm not mistaken, it should be available now, maybe? I'm not sure. Do I try and get a Mimi from it? <sighs> I don't know. We'll see. Um, so we'll find out what that, how much that's available for as well. So back for 24 hours, Moon only a mutant each day will run through that one mutant at a time uh power of friendship so you got three mutants for some gold um including pinky and the brain but the other two kind of most people will have them by now uh buy two get one free level five health uh orbs sort of thing well no they're not health they're um regen orbs uh, you got a different uh, Zodiac mutant uh, rotating through, as per always. Now in the exchange office, you got those couple of mutants. I think I've got them all, so they're not important to me. But again, check your bingo grids, see if they fill out something important. You've got three gold stars available for 50, 500 gold. Now this is good for the um, that new mutant that's out. You know, instead of spending 300 gold to get one, 3,000 gold to get one gold version of it, you can... If you don't get it, if you don't pull a platinum or gold for the 2,000 gold that it's worth, you know, it, just say you pull the gold version, you can spend 50 more gold to get three gold stars and you, odds are you should get, you should get another gold version out of it, but just keep that in mind, guys. I'm, I will go, I will get that because gold stars are really, really valuable, guys. So the next up, guys, we have... Uh, uh, Black Friday offer. So again, this is probably going to be a very good time to buy gold. Uh, yeah, you know, 2,500 gold. We'll, we'll look into it in more detail, see how much it's going to be worth. Um, power leveling. Just stay away from them, guys. They are not worth it. Um, Black Friday offer. So you got 10,000 gold. We'll, again, we'll look into it and we'll see how much um, how much that's going to be worth. And yet it moves. Three mutants for gold. Um, limited offer. We got the turkey box. So Thanksgiving box back. Um, that just looks a little weird. What well, we got one old Thanksgiving mutant, and then they've got Captain Patriot, Patriot there. Or, yeah, and some other George Washington. <laughs> Buy two, get one free. Level five. Retaliate orbs. And then the next week, guys. God, if my dog stop moving around on the floorboards, I can hear their feet. Uh, back for 24 hours only, mutant each day, we'll go through them one at a time. Black, another Black Friday offer of 5,000 gold, so again, we'll look to see how much that's going to be worth. Limited offer, you've got a cyber box available, uh, time to cyber up. So it looks like, yeah, that's, that's different. Well, you're going to purchase that, you're going to get Triad, a free shot at a, a cyber box plus gold and shield and ability and boost huh i don't know we'll, we'll hopefully see that in amongst that i'm not sure what that is uh you got the video game mutants back you know i like the way they look but again their stats aren't improved or anything guys so they're just not worth it um you've got a what's that just a challenge token you can get challenge tokens for real money and then they check in some gold in there to make it worthwhile. Big shot of mutosterone. You probably don't need that and don't need to waste the gold on it. On it. And finally back level five research box guys. Now before we dive into the details of the news guys, we've got a new mutant coming pretty soon. So here it is and you know, looks like a dinosaur, you know, back in, back in the Cretaceous or whatever the periods are. Um, yeah, it's just a single geno, so you're assuming it's going to be a beast, single beast attack, and then a, and then a spread attack of neutral or another uh, on a beast spread attack as well. So, but again, they could change things up. We all know Missy is a saber 
Cyber, but her attacks are Galactic and... I want to say Cyber, but correct me if I'm wrong. So, you know, they could do the same thing here. We don't know, but that's what it looks like. Looks cool. Looks like a dinosaur. It's pretty cool. It's not a picky mutant, but... <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, it's a new mutant nonetheless, guys. I'm, I'd like to see them pumping these out. Okay, so available on the 21st, 22nd, 23rd, and 24th. We've got all these. Uh, nano top tier. Same news as always, guys. If you haven't got the credit mutant, get it. It's a free mutant for credits. Um, and just check to see if the others feel out something important on your bingo grid. Like if, you know, if you spend 900 gold to to finish a row that gets you 1,500 gold. You're making 400 gold prof profit, why the hell not? So on the 25th, 26th and 27th, these bunch of mutants available again, you don't see them being used, so they're not high grade tier or anything. Uh, get the credit mutant as per usual if you haven't got it. Check the bingo grid for the other two, just in case they feel like something important. Um, look, I like the, the Necro one available on the 27th. It, it reminds me of my old school days when that muted first came out. I was like, yeah, get it. And, you know, healing back was pretty good, but it's it's not good. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm getting interrupted while recording, guys, because it's, it's my lunch break, though, so I'm getting annoyed with it. Uh, those mutants are available, again, none are really high tier, so just get the credit mutant and the same with the other two. Okay, so available also in this upcoming week, guys. You've got the speed box there for a thousand gold a pop. Not bad, not bad, I guess. Do I take a chance at it? Depends how much gold I'm gonna spend, I don't know. Uh, you got the three mutants there, available for 2,470 gold. Again, if you haven't got them all, then you're sort of saving gold, but they'll eventually all come available, you know, 800 plus each. I, again, they're not top tier, so I'd say stay away from it. But again, check the bingo grid. See if it's, see if it's worthwhile. That's all I'm saying. The um, other Zodiac Mutant there, again, you don't see them being used. They're, they're outdated. So, you know, unless you've got gold spare and you want to fill out the bingo grid, go straight ahead, guys. Um, you've also got the, uh, the, the Turkle Captain Gobbles or something like that. <laughs> I don't know its name, but yeah, Captain Goggles or something gobbles or something like that uh 1200 gold again you don't see it being used so don't waste your money unless it feels out something important in your bingo grid uh the regen orbs there so buy one get one three if you're a fan of regen go get it the uh, turkey box is there i would definitely like to see what's inside of it first before summoning 900 gold a pop is is quite expensive especially if there's nothing new in there uh, you got four, uh, $5, you can get 2,500 gold, not bad, so really good Black Friday um, offer there, guys. You've got three gold stars available for 500 gold. I'm definitely going to pick this up. You know, gold stars are hard to, to accumulate compared to platinum stars and things like that, so gold stars are way more valuable. I'm definitely going to pick this up. If you've got gold to spare, pick it up, but keep in mind, new mutants are normally worth 3,000 gold, so make sure you can at least afford the new mutants and things like that. Uh, XP jars, no, you shouldn't need to waste gold on these, but to each his own, the next three, three mutants available for 2,950 gold. Again, none are top tier, just check the bingo grid, and if you've got the gold, it's, yeah, again, something to stay away from for free-to-play players. Uh, the other Black Friday offer is $20 for 10,000 gold. That's, again, they, these are good, good value, good value. Next week, guys, on the 28th, 29th, 30th, and the 1st of December, these minutes available, none are top tier. You don't see them being used. Get the credit sell series. The credit mutant, if you haven't got it, see what the others feel out of the bingo grid. Same as always, guys. Uh, as as for the third, uh, second, third, and fourth, same deal. Pick up the credit mutant, see what the other two feel out. None are top tier. Uh, buy two, get one free. Level five retaliate orbs. Uh, another mutant there again that you don't see being used. Two thousand gold. That's pretty steep. Uh, cyber box available for seven hundred gold per summon. I don't like the, <laughs> I'd like to, to see, reduce the numbers of the mutants inside the box and so you know you better chances of getting the ones that you want to pull instead of one in 36 or plus odds. <laughs> uh, the other Black Friday offer is $10 for 5,000 gold. So these are really good value guys. These Black Friday sales are really good value. That's only if you're, you know, if you're, if you pay in the game. Um, so you've got the level five shield ability and level six 
shield boost orb for a thousand gold. Quite steep, but um, understandable. You, you, if you buy them separately, you're spending more. So if, you, if you're if you're all time, if, you, if a mutant that you're using a lot all the time is a shield mutant, then or or yeah, you, is it a mutant that you give the shield ability to? Then think about getting this guys. Might be worthwhile. You got Triad available for 1,500 gold now. Triad is a good mutant. You do see it being used. However, my, my problem with him is he's a fast mutant, but he's not the a spe your main speed mutant because you want the speed mutants to be the top, you know, five mutants in speed. This guy isn't in the top five, but he's still fast. It's 10 something, I think his speed is. So yeah, he, he's good, but he's he's... There's other faster mutants that will take him out first, like Zeus and things like that. You got the video games uh, mutants there, so pretty much you can get them all in one. Uh, again, they're just not great mutants. If they were boosted a bit, then yeah. Um, you got the Mutostrones available. Shouldn't need to waste gold on that, guys, you, especially if you're not a pay to play player. You got the challenge tokens, uh, you know, 20, 50, and 100. <laughs> dollars for for each of those and things like that you shouldn't need to get challenge tokens and if you want the gold go for the black friday sales guys and finally to wrap it all up you've got the level 5 research box for 750 gold guys um yeah it's a, again level 5 they're not top mutants anymore like i i can't think of i can't remember what the level 5 research mutants are guys but um you shouldn't need to to get to get it and waste 750 gold on a random one in 36 mutants. So, you know, it's yeah, yeah. I'd rather spend the 3,000 gold on getting a particular mutant than 750 for a one in 36 chance of getting one or two mutants that I want. So, yeah, guys, that's gonna be it. Yes, that is it for the news this week guys as per usual i forgot to say this at the start of the year all my information comes from Procrafield guys on facebook and as per usual his link is in the description below feel free to give him a um a share and follow and things like that guys you know he does all the data mining work here i just report it to you guys in a cheap sort of news program <laughs> but uh yeah guys so that's what's up upcoming and then um so that's only entering november so we're still We'll still be, by the time this is done, we'll still be um, about two, still, still two months off of Christmas. Um, whether Bounty Hunter will become available, I suspect he will, because there is a Christmas skin of him out there, so people might be holding their breath, even if it's for gold, you know, I'm sure people just want him to come back. Anyway, that's it from me, guys. Hope you enjoyed this news episode. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. If you want to go that little extra further, guys, and help your buddy picky out, feel free to share this video on any social media platform or form as you see fit. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!